Good morning, Wolfpack. I'm Isabel Herman. And I'm Sammy Bringus. Today is Friday, April 22nd, and we're here with your morning announcements. Just a reminder that today is the last day of state testing. Good luck, Wolfpack. Attention seniors, if you had Mrs. Benetport as a health teacher freshman year, please stop by Library 3 to pick up the your time capsule during Advo this week or during late lunch. The time capsules will be in boxes in the entry hall of Library 3. Are you wondering if you have a library fine or what to do with your AP textbooks? Are you a senior and wondering what to do with your Chromebook? Well, you're in luck because all of that information is posted online at the library website. Yesterday was the opening night of Wolfpack Performing Arts production of Cinderella. There will also be a show today and the 29th at 7 p.m. On April 30th, there will be shows at 2 p.m. and 7 p.m. Tickets cost $10. Scan the QR code shown to purchase tickets. CO's Community Club is hosting a food drive until May 16th. Drop off any canned or non-perishable food items to the culinary classroom for a chance to earn a CO ticket. Five students who donate the most items will also earn a Dutch Bros drink. Now let's pass it on over to Dylan and Paula for Pop. What's poppin' Wolfpack? I'm Dylan Brazier. And I'm Paula Cibulo. And this is Pop, where we pop in and show you posts of the pack. Now let's take a look at our Fantastic Friday posts. Looking great, guys. Now for this week's Wolf of the Week, let's check in with Sammy Bringus and Eden McGill. Hi, I'm Eden. Hi, I'm Sammy. And we're, we're your Wolves, Wolves of the Week. week. Um, on campus, I am treasurer of Equality Now, a newer club on campus. And um, I have also have been part of the broadcasting journalism pathway for about four years. And I used to play soccer for three years, but not anymore, but still have good memories of it. And for me, I'm like president founder of Equality Now with Eden. I'm um, also the Vice President of March for Our Lives. I'm in Linkru, I'm in NHS. I've also been in the Broadcasting Journalism Pathway since I was a freshman. And I played JV basketball for like two years, but it was nothing special. My favorite memory was definitely prom night because it was like, it was just such a good reward after being like on your computer for like two years. And um, it was super fun to like be with my closest friends and just like have like one good dance before we leave. My favorite memory is kind of funny because um, I didn't love playing basketball, but one of my favorite memories was uh, when the basketball team took us out on a field trip to tour Stanford. And we got to meet some of the girl players from the Stanford women's basketball team. We got to tour the school. And yeah, it was super fun, and we got to make a whole day out of it in Palo Alto. So I would totally do it again. So my plans are to go to Sac City and then transfer to uh, Sarah Lawrence, which has been my dream forever. But I think Sac City is going to be a good start. And if you don't know what you want to do, I would recommend community college. Uh, for me, I'm going to New York City. I've only applied to schools in Manhattan. I'm choosing between NYU and Fordham, but it's probably going to be Fordham because NYU is a little bit too expensive. <laughs> Don't worry about impressing too many people. Like You only know these people for a short time um, in your life, and if you're too busy trying to make them be happy, you're just not true to yourself. My advice for freshmen would be don't be afraid to apply to these big crazy schools like maybe even Ivy's. I know going into it I would never even think that I could get into NYU um, but like take it from me I literally got a D sophomore year in math 3 not telling you to get a D but I'm like telling you don't be afraid to apply to these big crazy schools that are out there and um, they want to know you so go ahead and apply if you're thinking about it. Thanks for having me. You guys on campus. <laughs> Knock knock. Who's there? To. To who? Oh, it's actually to whom. Thanks, guys. Good luck with the rest of the year. If you want to be featured on our next Friday's show, make sure to use our hashtag COHSWPTV. Well, Wolfpack, thanks for popping in with us. Back to the anchors. <laughs> I've never seen her in my life. Well, that's all we have for you today, Wolf Pack. And remember, the strength of the pack is the wolf. And the strength of the pack, the <laughs> strength of the wolf is the pack. Happy Earth Day, Wolf Pack.